Hello, and thanks for checking out ChartGuys.com. We're proud to be one of the most successful technical analysis communities online, teaching you the skills to become a more confident, effective, and informed trader. Join our community of hundreds of analysts worldwide working together to learn the charts, generate profit, and achieve financial independence. Sign up for a one-week free trial, no credit card required, for access to daily live chart analysis and market coverage, a thriving chat community, along with dozens of hours of exclusive educational materials. We look forward to seeing you. Let's check out some charts. Hey guys, James the Chart Guys. It's Tuesday, May 22nd. Going to do my nightly video on gold. So gold yesterday's video, I said that there was a bullish reversal candle on increasing bull volume, uh, but that we need confirmation by breaking above uh, this, the high of this bounce here at 1296.40. Bull still unable to break this 1296.40. And the longer we go sideways here, um, after such a big dump here, it does favor the bears for continuation. All this is doing is pulling off the RSI at this point as we move sideways. And the RSI is starting to move upwards north and the, the price movement is not going up. And so that's, so as we continue to sideways and the RSI continues up, any type of uh, move toward the upside is going to be limited because it's going to get oversold. I mean, overbought. Uh, the RSI is going to get overbought as it gets to that area. Look at the four hour. Very nice cooling off of the uh, four hour oversold RSI as we move sideways on gold. So keep that in mind that we have not yet, we did not uh, confirm the bullish reversal candle. Uh, so after the high of today of 1296, this 129640 is very important level to break for the bulls. And if, on any break, I want to see it on increasing bull volume. So um, today's volume, whatever it's at, Tomorrow, if we break it, I want to see it on increasing bull volume. I won't be convinced unless it's on increasing bull volume at this point um, at 1296.40. So anyways, looking at the smaller time periods, let's look at the hourly. The hourly here, the hourly here is forming a higher lows and higher highs, uh, but now we're back to forming lower highs and lower lows. So now we have support here at 1290.01. Uh, and resistance, the first resistance we'll be watching is 1294.10, uh, 1295.70, and then of course 1296. Uh, so that will be the hourly to be watching, GDXJ. GDXJ, we were, we did fill, we were in gap filled territory, not much follow through. Um, again, uh, we were in gap filled territory here, but look at the declining uh, bull volume and now increasing bear volume today. And so need to watch the support here at 32.58, 32.57. So basically a double bottom by a penny. Um, bears want to break this level on increasing bear volume. Bulls do not want that to, to break, those levels to break. Uh, still watching this monthly chart for this to play out. This equilibrium pattern of high, low, lower high, higher low, lower high, higher low, lower high, higher low. So far, another lower high being formed on the monthly. Hopefully, it'll play out sometime this year as we get tighter and tighter, and we'll get a break to play it one way or the other. U.S. dollar. U.S. dollar monthly. Key resistance, if, they, if, if bulls are able to break it, will be at 95.15. We have a 95.15, 95.149. That is a double top on the monthly. If bulls are able to break that, that'll be a big, big time win for the for the dollar bulls here. Uh, so that's going to be a very key resistance to be watching in the coming months as well. Looking at the daily. Daily yesterday's bear reversal candle not really confirming. Bulls bought the, bought, bought the dip today. Uh, looking at after the, the low of today of 93.291, the next support to be watching if we do break that is 93.118. So gold... Gold bulls want to break the low of today and then break this re the support here of 93.118 uh, and to see some further consolidation. And after we break that, we still have major support here at 92.243. So gold is not ready yet. Um, I can't emphasize that that uh, 12 96.40 level on gold futures enough as the key resistance to break on increasing bull volume. Have a good night and I'll see you tomorrow.